Who's the baddest cat with another good ass sequel? Shaft! Uh, I love this beat. Mm. He's a bad mother. Shut your mouth. What's going on, everybody? This is Ryan A. Polk with the wrap up. And as you can see, just saw Shaft a few days ago. And honestly, you know what? When I first saw the when I saw the poster for this, I thought it was going to be a reboot at first. But then when I saw the trailer, I was like, oh, OK, so this is a sequel, this is a sequel to the 2000 Shaft. No, we have to 19 years later. Man. But and you want to know something, though, man, you know, this right here was this right here was a good movie i mean it was i mean it was just so good because you know we got and you know we got we got richard we got samuel jackson and richard roundtree who are back and playing their roles of shaft one and also and also shaft two and then and then and we got some new faces such as jesse t usher who plays shaft's son and we got regina hall who who plays the mother of of um shaft of shaft jr jj as as what he is as his little has his nickname in the in the movie and this movie in this movie i mean it was just so entertaining i mean I didn't know what to expect from this movie, but I did still want to see it because I'm a fan of of these actors who are in this movie, and and also and I also do like Shaft. I mean, I've only seen I've only seen the 2000 Shaft. Still got to see the old ones, but it was but you know this Shaft was also another good one. It was it was a good Shaft, and this movie and then in this movie we find out that Shaft has a son, obviously. And, 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 and what his son is trying to figure out is, is a case of the death of his, of his best friend and not going to spoil nothing and don't want to dig too, too deep into it to make it seem like I am spoiling it. But the action in this movie was just incredible and Jesse T. Usher and Regina Hall were good choices for this movie because, because I mean, even though Samuel Jackson had me cracking up, I mean, De Regina Hall and Jesse T. Usher had me laughing too. I mean, Regina Hall was, you know, was the only person I could think of, man, who could probably keep Shaft in check. And Jesse T. Usher was, was one of the people who also made Shaft look stupid when it came to, especially when teaching him, you know, millennial stuff. Since since he since he is a millennial in this movie, and it was death, and it was and it was also. It, it, the the storyline for it was was good and it wasn't it, it wasn't it wasn't even boring like there wasn't nothing boring about this movie the everything was following through right on time and and uh and the and, and the way how you know how the way you know it it, it showed what happened it kind of shows what happened you know after after you know the the 2000 shaft in a way because it pretty much it show it kind of shows you that okay yeah it's not a reboot this is you know this is still a sequel in a way and and shaft though i do think i mean if you are a fan of the series i think you will be you you will be impressed and you will be pleased with this you will not be disappointed now the there has been mixed reviews with this movie and i know this movie hasn't really been doing so well in the box office and i'm disappointed with that because it should be doing so much better than 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 what it's doing right now in the box office and when if you're hearing negative reviews about this don't pay attention to the negative reviews shaft is definitely is definitely on the list of one of one of the best movies of 2019 nowhere near trash at all and i and i think that you know people are it almost seems like that like critics is sleeping on this however it was also funny because I had read something where it says that fans and like audience are 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 happy with this movie. So definitely listen to those opinions. I mean, the negative reviews don't pay that no mind at all. And Shaft and you know, with the way that this had ended, um, it does look like a sequel could be made. And and of course I'm gonna go see this sequel. I mean, because I mean I'm saying nothing but good things about this movie. And should you go see this movie? Of course. I mean, I mean that pretty. I mean, just listen to what I'm saying right now. I mean, as you can see, I mean, I haven't said nothing bad about it. I mean, the only thing that I that I would say 
is bad about it is that I don't know um it I don't know like maybe that maybe that you know I don't know maybe maybe you know you know Buster Rhymes wasn't in it or something like that maybe that's one of the bad maybe that's something bad about it or you know it probably you know it could have been longer maybe I don't know I mean can't really say nothing bad about it right now um but yes, go see this movie. This movie is entertaining. You will enjoy it and you will not be disappointed. It will not be a waste of your money. For Shaft, I give Shaft a I give Shaft a a B, a B plus. And for and for for its rating of out of five stars, I give it I give it four out of five stars. So yes, do not wait for it to come to the red box. Go see it ASAP. And this is Ryan A. Polk with the wrap-up, signing off.